Yeah, just gotta go to owner, and then I'll try to go on and I'll just switch back to coach. That probably built into it too. No, I won't build into it too. I can't kick, man. I can't kick with Justin Tucker. Uh, uh, uh. indoor. How do you want to do the playoffs? Like, if we win, you want to play, or do you want to? What the fuck? Uh, wide open run. If we uh, yeah, the playoffs. Uh, whoever goes is playing against PC, uh, CPU. Three three yard gains. That means they're putting the ball likely on fourth down. That's what you're looking for when you're playing defense. On second and seven, Brady. Oh, this is, oh, too far, idiot. He rifles one that's intercepted. Xavier Rhodes with a pick. And he will take this all the way down to the 38 yard line. And certainly, yeah. look, you're on the road in the playoffs. That is a suboptimal start, opening drive INT. And partner, sometimes I wonder do these teams talk about it to such an extent? Mm. And maybe you almost talk yourself into the turnover no. when you're trying to avoid it. Yeah, maybe they get a little too worried about keeping the football, and then you give it to the other team right off the bat. And look, we said it on the road. This is just a terrible, terrible start for them. It is, and now they've got to rely on their defense. Oh, shit, I missed the guy on that. And they'll get this one down to about the 20-yard line. The Steelers able to pick up 18 yards there. Well, there's plenty of real estate for him to maneuver on that run. And let's face it, it shouldn't be a surprise. He's one of the better backs in the league. Had to come into this game with the idea. Slow him down. Otherwise, it's going to be a long afternoon. Army, Army. Jim, 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 Jim. Check, 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 check. On first down, they go with Mostert again. And he is met at the line of scrimmage, and he goes down right there. Officially no gain on the play, and it's second down. So after the run for no gain, here's second and ten. I'm going to run you over. And can you put the mic? Check, 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 check. Right here, right here, guys. Fight 51. Operating from the gun, Watson. And he's going to find his man out of the backfield. That's complete. Not able to get a single yard. It'll bring up third down. But he caught it right at the line of scrimmage. And before he could even think about advancing it forward, he got hit. Great tackling because that's what you're taught. Don't give up yards after the catch. And most offenses make a living off of yards after catch. Those hidden yards that may not go into the score sheet. But they count big for moving the ball and stretching the field. Really nice open field tackle. Throwing on third down, Watson. And he will not be able to hang on through the contact. It's incomplete. The coverage strong, and now it's fourth down. They certainly had good starting field position on that drive, but couldn't do anything with it after three plays. Have to admit that that's a disappointing end to excellent field position. What? When that drive started, they had six points that they were thinking about. Oh, fuck you run to him like that ball. I'm to block the damn ball. And I always enjoy the conversation post because officials always I thought I was going to block too. But you caused the play. You did it. I had to. Come on, boy. Come on. Now, Moster. And yeah, this play doesn't go anywhere. Losing yardage to the 11. It's a loss of a yard there, and it's second down. An interesting and intriguing decision there defensively because they kept extra DBs on the field despite seeing the multiple tight end look that came out for the offense. I thought they were going to switch out of it. I didn't know if they felt they didn't have time or what the case was. Well, in any event, the extra speed allowed for great penetration as they stuffed that one behind the line of scrimmage. This will be caught at about the five. Oh, fuck, he catch that. And he'll be brought down here at the three-yard line. That catch good for eight, but still, it's third and goal now. Mike, Mike, check, check, 59, 59. Hey, tight, tight. Mike's 59. Mike's 59. I see the five. 
From the gun, Watson. And caught in the end zone. Touchdown, Steelers. From three yards out, and the Steelers have taken a first quarter lead. Things could just not have started any better for them. They get the turnover, the football right away, able to capitalize on offense for six. And we're talking about setting a tone in any game, right? The first points of the ball game, how about during the playoffs? Vitally important, and they've done that in this one. And Lambeau now, after the touchdown, he'll kick this one away. Mm -hmm. Bearcats <coughs> to the 25-yard line. The Bengals take over first and ten at their own. Well, I just trying to figure out what to do. The Bengals drive about to get going. They had the interception last time. It led to the opening touchdown. So now seven nothing to score as they start. Still has fullback Ben Blackman. He is met quickly in the backfield. Down he goes, folded like a lawn chair. Two yards, the loss, second and twelve at the twenty-three yard line. He go fishing by himself. He go fishing by himself. First play of the drive goes the wrong way. Here's second and twelve. Now a play fake. Brady. This one complete to me, Cole Hardman. <laughs> And they're going to get this beyond the 40 yeah. before he's taken down. That one, a gain of 20 Dude, been and a first down. I don't think he catch like that for a man. It's been touchdown. From the shotgun now, here's an inside give. <laughs> yeah, that too. And he'll be taken down just shy of midfield. <laughs> it's a six-yard gain on the ground, and that'll make it second and four. <laughs> That's all that guy spinning. Working from the gun, it's Brady. What the hell is that? I thought they can't throw to LT or something. What the hell is that? Now they face a third down and four after that incompletion on second down. Operating from the gun, Brady. He's going to hit his man out of the backfield, complete. And he is going to have a Bengals first down by about a yard. It's a gain of five on third and four. From the shotgun now, here's an inside give. And he is going to be stopped cold behind the line of scrimmage. Yeah. He'll lose a yard there, and it's second and 11. Second and 11 now. Brady. And they're going to have themselves another first down as the tackle's made at the Steelers' 30. The Bengals pass the game, finding a rhythm. They've got another first. Nice job there of utilizing his big target. He didn't overthink it. Understands the catch radius. Understands that he knows how to use his body to keep defenders away from the ball. And puts it right out there for the nice pickup. And he'll lose yardage. Brought down at the 32. That one unable to develop. Never got going. A loss of a couple. And it's second down. And he will cross the 30 down to the 29-yard line. It's a gain of maybe three, but it's going to leave him with still about eight or nine to go on third down. A three-yard pickup. And it's third down. From the shotgun now, here's an inside give. That is so slow. The hell is that shit? Let's go. Well short of the first down marker. Two yards on the pick up there. It's fourth down. For the Bengals field goal. A 44-yard attempt. It is a perfect kick, but still missed. Stay right where it is. Seven. These playoff games have a tendency to be tight. <laughs> Seven miles per hour wind, dude. It's perfect yeah, kick. They're doing out to the right. All the way to the right. Usually those happen in the second half or later in the game. This might be the key play of the game showing up here in the first half. And he still has yet to get on track in this first half as they're going to stop him behind the line. Two yards, the loss, huh? second and 12. Um, the opening play of the drive goes backwards. Now they'll come up on second and 12. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, after this game, I'll figure something else to do. Yeah. Hey, Chris. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and that'll be accepted, of course. 
<laughs> he's like, does that sometimes. So he's got either caught him out or just got a false start. Oh, yeah, D line. That's a gain of ten. Brings up third and seven. Right here, right here. Mike 51, Mike 51. Mike 51. Hey, 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 and this was a nice example of an offensive coordinator scheming his guy open. Just a little underneath route, just trying to free up some space. And it worked awfully well. Got him not just space, but plenty of room to run after the catch to pick up really nice yardage. Yeah. And there we saw one of the downsides of blitzing during a rundown because sometimes you get out of your gaps. You don't fit the run quite as well yeah. because you're headed towards the ball carrier with abandon. Oh, fuck, he pushed two linemen. Two, like, two, two yards. Yeah, it's pretty playoffs. nice over here. It's tough to figure out what to do, man. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Coming up at the half, as we've done all year, we'll get you to Jonathan Coachman in Orlando. Coach will have the lowdown on what's going on here in this wild card weekend as we begin on the road to Super Bowl 53 in Atlanta. And they'll try the jet sweep here. Oh, yeah, Timmy had a chance to slide. What the fuck, Ray Marjo Gary? Ray Marjo Jr., nobody relates. A very solid gain of 27. Run there coming from the wrong D formation with this. Yeah. I just put in the bag. These guys look like running backs, even though they're playing out on the perimeter. Well, they'll run it here on the jet sweep. And nothing doing. He's immediately taken down at the line of scrimmage. Walla. Let's just make this one succinct. Nice job there. All 11 guys on defense diagnosing the jet sweep and putting it down. Here's second and 10. Here's Moster. And he'll get this one down to about the 10 yard line. My Taz is a wet. yard there, but only a yard. Leaves him with third and nine looming. A gain of one. Brings up third down and nine. elsewhere to no avail a 27 yard attempt and Lambo will put this one through and the lead moves to 10 zip they put together a good little drive there really stalling out the red zone mm -hmm. yeah, no, people look at as a little bit of a negative they didn't get six points out of it right didn't get the touchdown but that's actually okay. They got three points. Able to give their defense a little bit of rest. Let them settle down over there. So all in all to me, that's a good drive. Yeah. And he's going to have the first down as they move into field goal range here at the 25-yard line. drive about to get going and you're under a minute to go in the half a first half that hasn't been particularly kind to you how do you think they'll play this well, i think the smart approach is to run out the clock lift your wounds at the half and see if you 
come up with a strategy to play better in the second, but there's also something to challenging your offense. Justin right Jefferson. You know, hey guys, you help dig this. A bunch of young deals defense still might be young. That's my quarterback is old. And they'll get this well past midfield before being stopped just before the 35. The Bengals going to use the second of their time. Fuck, revolution, fuck. As they'll stop the clock with 26 seconds to go until halftime. From the shotgun. I want to from this revolution. Yeah, boy, this defense again really making things tough on him as they stop him for no gain. No the running lanes have definitely not been there for him here in the first half, and I don't think it's all been his fault. His offensive line hasn't given him much space. A loss results there. Officially nothing on that last run. They'll try again second and ten. On play action, it's Brady. Taking a deep shot here for Hardman. And that will be incomplete. Try to dial up the long one way out there, but it'll be third down. I like what they did there because many of the deep throws we see in the course of a game come to the outside, the perimeter of the field. In this case, they use the slot receiver. I like this, to run I like this fucking kicker, man. That way. Unsuccessful in that attempt, but I like what they were doing. Yeah, I missed it. And he's going to miss this one. That is no good. Well outside the left upright. And this score will stay right where it is. This is terrible. That's the risk of the long field goal miss here at this stage of the second quarter. You give up great field position. And that gives them one more opportunity to make something happen and something big. And we've seen crazy stuff happen at the end of halves. That's going to wind up a loss of a full three yards on first down. So we're at halftime of this AFC wild card matchup. As we'll send you down to Orlando, we check in with Jonathan Coach for our EA Sports halftime report. I don't know what to do. Justin Tucker is set to kick off. Both teams try to avoid being one and done. Uh, in these with, well, I'm going to go with only Rocky. Yeah. Card game fielded in the end zone, and the half will begin with a touchback. <laughs> At the line to start their next drive. They built a good first half lead. Now they have a chance to add on to it. And what I'm thinking is that the offensive staff spent the entire halftime just working with them on here's what we think they're going to do to attack us in the second half. A nice first half that we've had, guys. But be prepared for some change ups. We're going to see them when we kick it off in the second half. See how they handle any adjustments that might be made defensively. Second and six, just inside the 30. 51, Mike. Mike 51. Hey, pick your game up. Hey, Mike 51. Check, 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 check. Check, check, check. From the gun, here's Watson. Yeah, I'll fucking slow ass technique going around Mosfar. And they'll get it up just short of the first time at the first time. Fucking slow ass technique going around Mosfar. Second catch of the game so far. This one moves the chains. If you're going to blitz, I'm likely going to leave you in man coverage with this guy, and that is less than ideal. It is because just about any offense that has an elite receiver. If you blitz and have him in man coverage, you're going to him, even if he has an elite defender on him, because he usually knows where the ball is before the defender does. And he'll work it across midfield inside the 45. 11 more on that one. my corner. My corner sucks. Only that one guy. First and 10 at the 44-yard line. I don't know, but I got no corners. You got tight right there. Watch twins. Watch twins. Kill, 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 kill. They'll stay on the ground. I got a dense award only. All these, all these other guys playing with me sucks. Well, the end of all that hitting and hollering, it was a four yard run, so the offense is going to go back down and feel pretty good about themselves. Defensively, you have to feel okay because yeah. you didn't let it turn into a bigger run, but the goal, shut it down for two yards or less. That's when you start to feel good about yourselves. Check, check, check. Hey, switch gear, switch gear. On second down, Mostert, and he is met in his tracks behind the line of scrimmage. Now they're going to be dealing with a third and seven. Is that one officially a loss of one? The first down line at the 34 here on third down. Hey, 31. 
A shotgun snap for Watson. And he's got his man in stride, complete. And he will have a Steelers first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. His first catch of this wild card game, and it's good for a first down. And this time they were ready for him as they'll stop him right at the line of scrimmage. By Miles Garrett. Tackle made there by Miles Garrett. Brings up second and 10 at the 28-yard line. Third quarter, wild card round. Thanks for being along for the playoff ride with us. Here's second and 10. They'll put those, those guys right there. Complete. And he's gonna take it in for a Steeler touchdown. That drive that really increased their cushion felt very military to me. Very precise. You probably had to change one of guys' number. And they just got it. And slowly but surely now starting to pull oh, away shit. a little bit. Things looking good for them. Let's check your tie ins. Not Maybe your tie ins got 84. Way, you mentioned that slowly but surely. Yeah, I think one of your tie ins. Yeah, yeah. I don't want to. Yeah, the fake random Yeah, the fake random was. Now he's back out there to boom this one away. Maybe with some yeah, frustration after the PAT miss. Here's me, Cole Hardman. Yeah, either you want to play against PC or what? On the return, the Bengals take over first and ten at their own 24-yard line. So you, you say you go to the Super Bowl, but you play the Super Bowl. Okay. The Bengals drive about to get going, and here we are, almost through three quarters. Oh, you just, this you can just pick his computer too. Not really found any kind of rhythm. Put it mildly, because they're not even over one. Yeah, they're good. They're good. I mean, they're not good, but they're cheap. They're pretty cheap. And all Madden, all pro, they suck, but all Madden is the same as uh, almost like playing me. And he'll give it here to his running back. And he'll get up near the 35, right at the 35. Yeah, oh, man, it appears pretty good. Four yards to pick up, first down. Now Brady. What the fuck is this guy doing? Ebron, idiot. <laughs> Ebron just stood there. With his hands up like an idiot. And a six yard gain gets him right around the 43. Six yards on that last play. Here's second and four. That the Teddy Clark dumbass got hurt. Brings up second and four. Uh, one quarter remains for the right to survive round one here in the AFC. Rogers. I mean, yeah, high pink though. So Rogers too old. Yeah. This is what, 36, 37? On yeah. Montez Sweat. Watson. And he'll be hit as he releases it. And that'll fall incomplete. I got D line for years to come, but I just need corners. It would have been the first sack of the game instead. They're able to influence the release, and they did force the incomplete pass. Yeah, I saw something. They're like a bunch of TVs in the back. I hope I get one of them. Give him seven yards on the play as they do pick up the third down conversion. So from the 36 now, first and 10. Watch out, watch out, watch out. The sweat and the guy Garrett. Once again, it's Mostert. And he'll lose yardage on the play back at the 37 yard line. Officially, it's a one yard loss. That's going to bring up second and 11. Brings up second and 11 at the 37 yard line. Hey, let's go, 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 let's go,
On second and 11 now. Watson. Going down the middle and it's complete. Yeah. I was a fucking horrible corner. That, that Cobra. He's a safety. You don't know why he's playing corners. Different story here. Over 20 yards. And let's get this. Get this. Mike 51. Mike 51. From the shotgun now. Here's an inside give. And not able to break away this time as they're going to stop him right around the line of scrimmage. <laughs> Two yards the loss. Second and 12. And 12. At the 18 yard line. I can't believe they let you play. Switch it, switch it, switch it. Come on, switch it. Hey, we got a snap. On second and 12. Watson. Now the, they'll be forced to slow. What the fuck, Comrade? Touchdown, Steelers. I'm being played in the middle, too. I don't know what the hell they're doing. And the Steelers are going to add on to their lead. Well, look, this is a team, Charles. They faced adversity. That was my guy. My slow ass team Lee. Slow ass. I'm fucking playing PO. That Ed Reed, though. I don't know what Ed Reed was doing. I play Ed Reed in the middle, too. Josh Lambo. And Lambo now, after the touchdown, he'll kick this one away. Fair catch made at the 25 yard line. The Bengals take over first and ten at their own 25 yard line. The Bengals drive about to get going. And let's face it, this drive is not going to have any bearing on this game, but it's kind of important for one reason, isn't it? It certainly Fucking is. Fucking all trash, man. And okay, all right, I'm being facetious here. But you get points, you feel a little bit better about yourself as you move on to the next one. What the hell time are you doing that? Accepted a third time. Hey, he beat him off the jam. Probably. That's the story of the game. They've been suffocating all game long on defense. They were suffocating there again in a big way. And they've done it not just by out-athleting them, which is often the case, but by being able to adjust to anything they tried to throw at them and beating them to the punch each and every time. This was a defense that was well prepared. So they'll get another shot on offense following that pick six. And now the kick is away. Fair catch made at the 25-yard line. The Bengals take over first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. The Bengals drive about to get going. They are most likely steering a cold into their season here in this wild card round. Nothing has gone right so far. And they are, to be frank, in desperation mode now as they begin with the first and ten. That catch good for only a couple. A gain of two. Brings up second down. To throw again on second down. Shit, they're too early. Just wait it. Down the numbers. There he goes. And he brings this one back. It's a pick six. Too early. Come on, Tom Blady. Defensively, they've had their way in this one. That pick six makes that scoreboard even more lopsided. I remember talking with a guy in the league, and I said, What do you do when the game's like this? You know, it's pretty but much. I'm trying to see what you want. He said, Oh, heck no. I want to stay on the field. I might get some. I'm trying to see what you want to draft on. There's like six QBs at number one. When they have to throw it, that gives you more opportunities to go get it. Oh shit, what the fuck are we turning for? Should've touched back. Yeah, but look at uh, <laughs> so keep you in the draft. Game's over, I'm gonna run the puck out. And at this point, maybe you say, you know, it was a good effort, really just to make the playoffs. They couldn't win their division, but did earn a wild card berth. It does appear, however, that their season is just... Oh, he pushed me out of the way! Another interception! That's not a blitz, though. That's not a blitz, though, but I saw the blitz, but he pushed me out of the way. Play best and friends on offense, man. Yeah, I need corners, too. Slot corner sucks. Two minutes remaining here in the fourth quarter of what has been a one sided affair. So the Steelers with the football as we get you reset. And let's see what they've come up with offensively yeah. after having Ch time to talk it over. And that is not uh, I'll look into it. I'll see if there's anybody in the, 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 the,
Oh shit, what the fuck? Yeah. Yeah, I got a young receiving core, just you know, quarterback Tom Brady used to hold. Hey, yeah, you were there the whole, whole there the whole time, dumbass. I put him like that the whole fucking game. So who the fuck is 4 2 no name corner? Well, so much of playing quarterback in the snow comes down to trying not to do too much. You've got to just keep telling yourself, throws downfield, we've run every day in practice all year. But guess what? They suddenly become more difficult. And this one gets away from him and winds up an interception. And he goes down, but not before getting this inside the 25. A gain of 26 yards. On first and 10, here's Brady. Oh, he's able to hustle him here as he pulls it in. And it's a five set for Tom Brady. Dude. Choked him this fucking player again. They'll try and run for it on first and goal. And he'll take this into the end zone for a Bengal TD. Justin Taking it in from two yards out. And thanks to the interception, the Bengals offense cashes in with six. The kick is good. And he'll bang that one through. Makes the score 37. Bengals seven. Tucker now to kick it away following the touchdown. That'll be taken about a yard deep. And they'll get him down right at the 25 yard line. So the same How did I must do the retaining team? The hell? <laughs> the Steeler offense here about ready for their next drive. And this game comfortably in hand. The scoreboard speaks for itself. But you still got your starting quarterback out there. When, when do you go to the backup? Let him get some time. And that's one of the great questions in the NFL, Brandon, because I'm just going to tell you in the 2015 season, commentated on three games in a row that were blowouts and in none of them did the starting quarterback ever come out of the game for the team that had a big lead and in each instance I asked the coaches later on to sweat and they all looked at me and said just don't really do that in the NFL. We, we, you know, these guys play, and we just play them all the way through. Now, in certain situations, they will take them out, but for the most part, they're not as worried and concerned about getting them out of the game. And that's always puzzled me a little bit. The Bengals sweat again. And they just took a timeout with two seconds to go. This one obviously decided. Not sure they needed to take it, but we'll take it with them. Third and long, it's Watson. He's gonna loft one deep over the middle. Throw. And it's incomplete. Fucking over corner, Colbert to too. End, but now this mm. game is over. Their coaching staff, they were pretty adamant beginning of the year. Our goal is to get to no, the no, Super Bowl. No. Well, they made it to the playoffs, that's part one, but they fall. Hmm? Uh, I don't want to compute this team, though. Because I built that team. So I'll just, I'll just let computer play. Well, it depends whoever it goes. Depends who goes. Go to the next round. Let's see. Oh shit. Pause.